today we will see how to sort a linked list right uh, so i will be implementing selection sort in the linked list so the procedure is what we will do we will take two pointers p and q right so for every value of p q will traverse the list right and whenever q finds smaller value than p right it will swap like in this in this procedure also will q will traverse like this and when q will reach 11 so these two values will get swapped 11 and 20 will get swap we will call swap function or we will write swapping uh, function right and then after that also it will keep on like for every value of p q will keep on traversing the left part means other part of the list right so slowly what will happen we will be having sorted sub array means inside an array sorted part in one side and unsorted in, in other side and slowly this so everything will be getting sorted actually so i will just write a pseudo code uh, so complexity for this algorithm will obviously will be order of n square why because for every part of p we are traversing a list means for every element we are traversing linked list uh, each and every time right so this is the pseudo code we will write selection sort as a name right i will pass head pointer of the linked list so this is how we pass struct node and star first so this is how the function will be called sub head head pointer will be passed here actually this head pointer will be passed here right so in first then i will take some pointers struct node i am taking star p local pointer which will be pointing to first pointer of the linked list right and then i need one pointer q right and we can declare one variable temp here also and later it in local scope also right then I will write while p. While p means whenever p is having some value, just keep on repeating the thing. Right? So while p, what I need to do for now I am initialize q pointer. Q is equal to p next. So if you are following this series, so next is this link part, right? Q next. Right? And if q is having some value keep on moving q q equal to q next so this inside loop is it this will keep on moving in the right direction right for every value of p right now what we need to do if value of p means p data right if value of p is greater than right greater than and equal to if value of p is greater than or equal to q data so what I need to do, I will, if the value of P data is greater than Q data means the value of second one is smaller actually, the smaller value is there. So I will put, this is simple swapping, right? In temp put P data, data of P will, we will keeping in temp and then we will swap actually, the swap of values actually, P and Q, we will swap the values like we have done here, right? So then P data will be replaced by Q data, right? And after that, I will be doing that temp value will be going to Q data. This is simple swapping, right, with the linked list, right? So for every P, keep on doing this, right, this inside loop, and after we have checked for one value keep increasing p also p equal to p next right so this function simply is this for loop is still here right so this function simply is implementation of selection sort right so we will code this also but this is how we do it right we just take a pointer p this is called selection sort merge sort we have seen in the last lecture also that also can be implemented so i have covered another algorithm with 
the help of this for every value of p move q pointer in the right direction right and whenever you get smaller value just swap keep on swapping that right so we'll see how to get how to implement let's it. see how to implement selection sort on the linked list so i will just display the original linked list which is already there i have just run code 20 30 11 33 this is unsorted linked list so we'll write and this part we have seen in previous lectures also how to display node how to create a linked list right so i will just write one void function void selection sort and in it struct node and first pointer right and in it i will take struct node type of pointer local pointer star p which will be pointing to first and then I will take one pointer star Q and and not temporary variable will be type of int. So I will just write int temp. In pseudocode I have written it here only, but means this is understood, right? Integer type of pointer, right? So while P means whenever P is having some value, do this for q equal to for and in for loop q is equal to p next p next and if q is having value till that point and q equal to q next right what we need to do take a variable temp right and in temp store the value of p right so first we need to check actually if p data is greater than or equal to q data if it is greater than q data just swap the values right take value of p in temp right and then in p data replace this value with q data right and then q data is equal to temp this is simple simply swapping of numbers right and after this while loop after this for loop just keep on incrementing p equal to p data right so uh, means not data p link so that is next right so yeah this is it this is how we write selection sort algorithm so now what i will do i'll just call this function selection sort and in that i will pass same head pointer in here and after sorting again we will see how this link list is being displayed right so i'll just save it and just run this code Right. So we can see the earlier link list is 20, 30, 11, 33. Now this link list has been sorted. 11, 20, 30, 33. Right. So now we can change the value of link list and we can keep on experimenting with this. So this is how we sort a link list using selection sort.